Is this the largest dog breed on earth? Why is this dog often called the ugliest? Was this breed a gift from the Dalai Lama? Is this dog so frail it needs clothes? Dogs 101 celebrates man's best friend. Today, the Chinese Crested, the Lhasa Apso, the Italian Greyhound, the English Mastiff, and we start with the breed that might be the smartest of all. Meet the Border Collie. It's a pretty smart dog. Border Collies are the most intelligent breed on the planet, without a doubt. Non-negotiable. End of story. Okay, so it's a really smart dog. In fact, on nearly every ranking of doggy intelligence, the Border Collie comes out on top. It's a highly intelligent dog, highly trainable dog. The Poodle and German Shepherd usually round out the top three most intelligent breeds, but Border Collies are canine rocket scientists. Think twice about these dogs as house pets, though. They are not good with novice dog owners. If you don't work with a Border Collie, they're going to drive you nuts and they will destroy every possession you have. The breed is named for the border region of England and Scotland. Shepherds in this area carefully bred dogs over many generations. The result is a dog that may just be the perfect herding breed. I don't think there's any dog that excels um, better at herding than Border Collies. The Border Collie is a born athlete. Its muscular, supple body is bred for speed and stamina. Very, very hyper. A dog that loves to run, loves to herd, loves to chase animals. Shepherds were also attracted to their Border Collie's fiercely intense stare, sometimes called the eye. Border Collies use this gaze to intimidate and control livestock. When they're focused on something, it is very hard to break that concentration. That great intelligence is the key to this herding dog's prowess. Border Collies were bred to complete complex tasks, both with humans and independently. When you hear the term man's best friend, a Border Collie comes to mind. A fourth unique physical characteristic gives the Border Collie even more of an edge. When herding, the dog can move quickly in a crouching position. It's reminiscent of a stalking cat. This trait is due to a space between the tops of the shoulder blades. The almost locomotive movement allows the Border Collie to make subtle adjustments to manage a herd with absolute precision. I can't think of many dogs that are as driven and focused as Border Collies. Spin, spin, good, pull over, other way, play dead. All the way dead, Venus. One, two, three, no. Nine. Today, Border Collie enthusiasts like Animal Planet's expert trainer, Zach George, are finding new creative outlets for this remarkable breed. Border Collies are exceptional at dog sports. Good. Good. Go. Go. Zach's high-flying Collies go for big air when chasing Frisbees. They also have a few head-turning tricks up their sleeves. Zach's Collie Venus even knows her multiplication tables. What is three times two? Nice. Across the pond in Wales, border collies continue to be a vital part of sheep farming. Just ask Welsh Shepherd and one of the top border collie trainers in the UK, Jerry Lewis. The border collie, in my opinion, is the most superior and by far the best dog too heard and look after sheep like dad down there come by we, you, we. if they train correctly and handled correctly then they will do pretty near anything actually jerry and the family run a 300 acre farm with nearly 800 sheep ewes and lambs it's a big job managing a farm this size the work the border collies do here is vital 
This particular dog sport here has been a very good servant to me over the years. He's got guts, he's got courage, he's got working ability, class to watch. He will give everything for you in terms of working under harsh conditions as well. Along with Spot, Jerry's dogs Pip and Flash are seasoned pros with classic Border Collie instincts. The size of their heart um, counts a great deal for me. And a dog that will get on with it and, and shows that intensity and that desire to work sheep. Hey there, stay. These dogs might work for a living, but they're loved pets all the same. You want to treat them as a friend. It's a real bond plus a professional relationship with a sheepdog. To get a sheepdog to this level takes considerable time and training. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Yeah, but Jerry will start by exposing young pups to sheep. My latest arrival and hopefully my next future champion. The dog learns a series of simple verbal commands. After mastering these verbal commands, Jerry graduates the dogs to whistles. Uh, two different sets of commands, actually, which I translate. This dog is on one set of commands and the other dog is on another set of commands. If I put too many commands, I get myself confused. By the end of the process, each Border Collie is able to understand a complex language that allows it to work in perfect harmony with Jerry. These two Border Collies that I got here, I'll put the sheep anywhere you ask me to put them. Anywhere? Collect call, border collie style. Along with making farm life easier, the talents of these collies are proven to be a smash hit on the internet. Challenged by a local film crew, hey, hey, Jerry and his collies took to the hills of Wales to arrange sheep lit with LED lights into a variety of images and shapes. millions of views the video has become the latest YouTube sensation Jerry welcomes any chance to showcase the talents of his border collies as a special thanks to dogs 101 Jerry and his dogs even arrange sheep in the shape of our logo this amazing feat is more proof of the uncanny ability of the border collie Every good shepherd, in my opinion, has to have a good dog. He's a vital cog in the works and helps me in the raising of our sheep on this farm, and I basically couldn't do without him. Whether it's herding sheep, playing frisbee, or performing amazing tricks, training is where this breed shines. But if you step up to a border collie, you better know what you're doing. If you don't know what you're doing, you could end up with a dog who is incredibly destructive. This is not a good apartment dog. I would definitely want to see this dog in a rural environment. Besides some concerns for hip dysplasia and eye issues, border collies are generally healthy. For the most part, these guys live to a ripe age. There are several coat types, each with slightly different grooming requirements. But in general, this is an easy dog to groom. Brushing and combing is essential because the dog does shed. It's a double-coated breed. If its need for mental stimulation and exercise is met, the Border Collie is a wonderful family pet. But if you don't provide for its needs, watch out. If you don't focus that hurting instinct, they are very likely to start hurting your children, which means nipping at their heels. In general, the Border Collie thrives with lots of space and activity. It's an extremely healthy dog with relatively light grooming needs. Those super smart, Border Collies won't just lie down for anyone. This breed is definitely not for everyone, but if its needs are being met, the Border Collie is a good family dog. Fiber Classum has been one of the most faithful dogs that I've ever had the pleasure of working or handling anyway. When Dogs 101 continues, meet the breed that some say is the ugliest. This 10-pound wonder is a full-blown hero. Is this the largest breed on the planet? 
Did this delicate dog inspire some legends of heavy metal?